It was difficult for me to intake information as a child. I pretty much went through grade school, middle school, and high school not absorbing a lot of the information. And I didn't know why. I found out later that I was dyslexic. It wasn't that I couldn't read, it was that the information that I was trying to read didn't stick. I've always been fascinated with science. I've been writing and telling stories ever since I was a little kid. Maybe I was being naive, but growing up, I never truly understood how science couldn't be fun for someone. Learning's all about communication. How do you relay the wonder of these physical science topics? To us, using comics for learning makes so much sense. Every day, we convey information through words and images. What do I like about comic books? When images and words work seamlessly together to paint a picture in my head. What makes comic books different from books or movies and any other media is the space in between each panel. That space creates the illusion of time from panel to panel, allowing the reader to fill in the gaps. The images capture the children's imagination. The words act as a guide through the story. Together, they make the perfect learning tool. The characters are larger than life. Putting them into a comic scenario, which is usually reserved for superheroes and fantastical situations, just makes sense. It shows how amazing and spectacular these concepts really are. Hopefully, the series will find its way into the hands of kids dealing with the same problems that I did. I think we've really accomplished something here. These books are a new and exciting introduction to the world of science. I know I'd read them if I were a kid.